Hey everyone, let's check out what I got at the thrift store today. I got a bunch of comics, actually. So I got a big run of Max Comics. There's number 8, 9, 10. Look at that great cover of Mr. Gone. Number 12, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, Beware the Hooli. 19 with this amazing creature chasing the max. And 20. Now it just wasn't max comics that I found. I also got some uh, interesting independent stuff. So here is from Eclipse Comics, The Dreamery. There's some wolves. I don't know what they're up to. This is number 10. Let's see some independent stuff right here. This is Star Rangers. Uh, I don't know what company it's from. Star Rangers number 2. And what do we have here from DC Comics slash... Slash Maraud, number one. And right here, check it out. Independent comics all the way. This is from Red Circle Comic Group of the Blue Ribbon, number two. Mr. Justice? And then we've got Eagle, number two, from um, Crystal, Crystal Comics. A little something a little more mainstream, Dark Horse 20 Years. This is pretty recent. And something else really independent, really interesting. Check it out from Now Comics. Silver Ring, Silver Wing, number one, January. This is an Anthropomorphics. And then from, uh, let's see, what's this one? This is Red Fox. Uh, I'm not sure what uh, publisher it is. There's their logo up there. Painted cover, and then something else a little more modern, Perfect Dark, from uh, Prima Games, publisher of all of those strategy guides. And right here we've got a crossover, Gen 13 and the Max. And finally, wow, The Adventures of Ford Fairlane, number two, DC Comics. Yes, Andrew Dice Clay had a comic book back in the day. So thrift stores, they've always got something interesting.